the Portage and Main Boilers, deserving of a second look. The EGR series, heat exchanger facts. In order to burn smoke cleanly, temperatures up to 2000 degrees Fahrenheit are required. With these extreme hot temperatures, it makes sense to have a high efficiency flue tube heat exchanger. For years now, it has been recognized that the flue tube heat exchanger has the best efficiency. Just one of those things, just like the wheel. Like the wheel, for example, you can improve on round. The only way to improve is to add more. No surprise then, the Portage and Main Optimizer EGR models do have more. In fact, as you're taking a second look, you will see that the EGR comes with a second set of flue tubes as standard for great heat transfer efficiency. Wow, two sets of high efficiency flue tube heat exchangers? Some brands only have one set or less. The EGR100 has six horizontal flue tubes and six more vertical flue tubes. On the EGR250, you will find eight horizontal flue tubes and eight vertical flue tubes. The flue tubes are seamless and are two and three eighths of an inch in diameter. The heat leaves the reaction chamber at the front of the boiler and does a 180 degree turn and enters the horizontal heat exchanger flue tubes. The heat then travels horizontally through the heat exchanger flue tubes all the way to the back of the boiler, where it transfers the heat into the surrounding water. When the heat reaches the end of the horizontal heat exchanger flue tubes, it does a 90 degree turn inside the water surrounded access junction chamber. Now the heat heads up the vertical heat exchanger flue tubes to begin the process of transferring as much heat as possible into the water surrounded vertical tubes. We even have our exit junction chamber surrounded with water to transfer as much heat as possible. This process gives maximum heat transfer and minimal heat loss before exiting the chimney. The hot burn means that all the smoke is burnt off. There isn't any smoke left to form unwanted creosote inside the flue tubes of the boiler. Cleaning the EGR heat exchanger flue tubes could be left for an extended period of time and it would still be more efficient than boilers with less flue tubes than the EGR has as standard. That being said, the cleaning process has been simplified so that it only takes a few minutes, bi-weekly or monthly, to clean the flue tubes and protect your investment. The vertical tubes at the rear of the boiler are easily cleaned by working a handle that moves the tubulators in the flue tubes. This removes dust from the tube walls and into the rear clean-out chamber. The bottom horizontal flue tubes are cleaned as necessary. The negative pressure suction combustion fan helps to keep the dust to a minimum. The brush supplied with the EGR makes quick work of cleaning. Simply push the brush through the horizontal fire tubes and into the access junction chamber. The efficiency of the heat exchanger system is what truly sets the portage and main apart from all the rest. And these are the mini facts of your EGR series heat exchanger. We hope you've enjoyed our Portage and Main Boiler Minifacts video. And thank you for taking a second look.